What are the reaction to a foreigner in Japan? That's the topic today. Hello, this is me again, Martina. Yeah, the overall reaction is positive. It's, it's typical Japan. It's everybody is friendly to you. I will talk today about the special encounter I had. When I first came to Japan, I lived in Yokohama. This is half an hour from Tokyo. It's a metropolis and people were super friendly. What surprised me the most, we lived at Yokohama station, is that everybody greets you. Ohayou gozaimasu, ohayou gozaimasu. I thought that was very unusual, but it was more like this crocodile dundee moment for me when everybody said uh, oh, good morning yeah i found this this was very strange for such a huge city uh, the people in tokyo in that time were very friendly for example when i moved to dubai and came back and clearly my japanese was not there i lost orientation all the time with the trains in tokyo i remember arriving in tokyo and I had to take the Shinkansen to Niigata. And this lady, I asked her, she helped me to switch the trains, rode with me on the train for at least two, three stations, and then she brought me to the right line. This was incredible friendly. She went out of her way to do this. This is unbelievable. It, they were super duper friendly. I'm living now one hour from Tokyo and the people are super friendly here. It's considered countryside. The population here is 400,000, but it's definitely a different vibe than Tokyo or Yokohama. In my area, are a lot of Americans and foreigners so the people are pretty much used to it and I do not get any different treatment or actually everybody treats me like a local however the conversation between us uh, this is not there that's the only thing which is different but this seems to be this culture between Americans and locals so there is a little a barrier between. What specific is different to maybe the foreign male to the foreign female is the male are much more welcomed than the female. So there is a completely different vibe if I go out with my sons or if I'm alone. Um, you do not get the same attention, this is for sure. I do have a nice story about this. I mean, I have a few stories, but let's talk about this one story. When uh, here in the community centers, they offer you Japanese lessons. And I went every Tuesday there. It was a really good lesson. Everything was great until the first American arrived, male American. or there was another guy, it was a French guy, and there was a German guy. And you were sitting basically at the table, they were created like, I don't know, superheroes. And <laughs> one time I had lessons with one of the guys and the whole attention turned to the guy. And it just was not because he was new, because he was a, he was coming to these lessons whenever he was in Japan. And it doesn't matter what I asked. <laughs> no answer. The guy got all the attention. And this happened a few times to me and I was <laughs> like, okay, I'm not going anymore. When I go to Niigata, um, I go to the Ryokan and visit the onsen. In the onsen, everybody is nude, naked and... Uh, <laughs> The females don't check you out so much. I mean, there is a side uh, uh, view, but that's it. There is no really checking out or something like this. However, when I come in, you can see all this uh, moment. You know, when there's uh, relaxing in the hot bath, 
and then the foreigner, the guy joining is coming in. And you see them and you see, you feel basically the view on you when you wash yourself. And um, the moment you, st either uh, some are going out immediately of the hot bath or the moment I step in, they count basically until three and they're out of the water. I had in my 15 years only three encounter where they stayed in the hot bath or in the onsen and two times they tried to speak to me and that's it. Uh, <laughs> they definitely go out. They are freaked out by me going into the onsen. Another thing is the mixed onsen. We went to the mixed onsen and um, I mean I have the video here. It's seaside and you are wearing some kind of a swimsuit yeah and the males are completely nude they have their little onsen towel and my husband told me if you want you can come over uh, but the male were not allowed on our side so anyway i went to my side and i thought okay let's do it <laughs> so i went to the male side and in front of me were three Japanese women. They went in and the men were all cool. You could, nobody were moving there at that time. No? And they were sitting outside. So all presented. However, I came in, everybody swept, slipped into the deeper water. <laughs> I thought that's quite funny. What I would like to know, if you're a foreign woman in Japan, if you agree with me that women are treated differently like uh, than our male counter because either it's in my mind but I really think uh, I have this experience here let me know in the comment section okay I see you in my next video bye